This is meteorologist Jeff Chapman with the National Weather Service in Sioux Falls, South Dakota, with an updated multimedia weather briefing regarding the blizzard expected to impact areas of the region for Sunday into early Monday. The storm will begin to impact the area later tonight as rainfall spreads northward out of Nebraska. As it encounters cooler air to the north, there will be a change or a mix to some snow in areas generally around Interstate 90 and northward and across portions of South Central South Dakota. Temperatures are such that a little bit of cooling could cause this transition to occur quicker and in areas a little bit further to the south, but right now we're expecting accumulating snow to be mainly north of Interstate 90, especially across portions of southwest Minnesota where several inches of snowfall will be possible from later tonight into early Sunday. Gradually we'll, we'll see winds increase across the western portions of the area and where heavier snow is expected as much as 5 to 12 inches from south central into east central South Dakota and southwest Minnesota. When those winds increase we will see blizzard conditions develop as winds increase to 30 to 45 miles an hour. In fact the snowfall totals for the event are expected to be greater than 10 inches from south central South Dakota into the mid-James Valley and then east along Highway 14. To the south and east, some warmer air will limit amounts to where most of northwest Iowa is expected to receive an inch or less. Rain will begin to spread north this evening and as it moves into that cooler air, we will see that accumulating snow begin later tonight across southwest Minnesota into east central South Dakota and also across south central South Dakota. This transition from rain to snow will progress eastward during the day Sunday and again the heaviest amounts are expected to be in the areas shaded by purple and white on the image to the left. Another facet of this system as it strengthens on the day Sunday will be increasing winds which will start early in the day out in the far western south central South Dakota areas where we'll see winds of 20 to 30 miles an hour increase as they spread eastward across the area through the day and by the evening most of the area will be experiencing winds gusting between 30 and 40 miles an hour. The impact of this wind with the snowfall expected will be widespread blowing and drifting snow with visibilities of a quarter mile or less meaning blizzard conditions uh, over much of the area. In fact the orange areas in this image uh, including all of southwest Minnesota and into portions of East Central and Southeast South Dakota are now in a blizzard warning for this event. Bordering that to the south, an area with lesser snowfall expected to have a winter weather advisory and where snowfall is expected to be the least, just a wind advisory for areas of Northwest Iowa generally along and south of Highway 18 and the extreme southeast corner of South Dakota along with Northeast Nebraska. For those with greater travel interest across the area, the heavy snow band will extend from portions of north central Nebraska through south central into northeast South Dakota and on into north central Minnesota. This band will experience between 10 and 15 inches of snowfall and will also experience those winds of 30 to 45 miles an hour creating blizzard conditions. For additional information, be sure to stay tuned to local media outlets as well as visit our website at www.weather.gov forward slash Sioux Falls. You can check on road conditions by dialing 511 or checking out safetravelusa.com. But in this situation, remember, with the blizzard conditions expected, travel is not recommended.